Hello and welcome to the session. Today I am there to help you with polynomials. Let us discuss the following question. If two zeros of the polynomial x4 minus 6x cube minus 26x square plus 138x minus 35 are 2 plus minus root 3, find the other zeros. Let us write the key idea that we will be using in the question. A real number alpha is a zero of a polynomial P of X if P of alpha is equal to zero. Now the let us write the solution. Given to us is P of X is equal to X4 minus 6X cube minus 26X square plus 138X minus 35. And given zeros are 2 plus root 3 and 2 minus root 3. Now, therefore, x minus 2 plus root 3 into x minus 2 minus root 3 is a factor of p of x or x minus 2 minus root 3 into x minus 2 plus root 3 is a factor of p of x or opening this bracket we get x square minus 2x plus root 3x minus 2x plus 4 minus 2 root 3 minus root 3x plus 2 root 3 minus 3 is a factor of P of X. Now solving this root 3X and minus root 3X cuts off and minus 2 root 3 plus root 3 cuts off. Therefore now writing the remaining terms, we get x square that is combining all the x terms minus 2x minus 2x that is minus 4x. Now combining all the constants, so we get 4 minus 3 that is plus 1 is a factor of p of x. Now we divide. P of x by x square minus 4x plus 1. So we have our divisor as x square minus 4x plus 1 and our dividend as x4 minus 6x cube minus 26x square plus 138x minus 35. Now solving this by long division method we get x4 divided by x square gives us x square. So x4 here minus 4x into x cube gives minus 4x cube plus 1 into x cube gives plus x square. Now subtracting this do not forget to change the signs while uh, subtracting. This gets cut off, so we are left with minus 6x cube plus 4x cube, which gives us minus 2x cube minus 26x square minus x square gives minus 27x square. The rest terms as it is plus 138x minus 35. Now again, minus 2x cube 
divided by x square gives minus 2x. So minus 2x cube here. Minus 4x into minus 2x gives plus 8x square. Minus 2x into 1 gives minus 2x. Now subtracting this. And don't forget to change the signs while subtracting. So we get here 35x square. Plus 140x and minus 35 as it is. Now again solving it further we get here minus 35x square plus 140x and minus 35. Again do not forget to change the signs by subtracting. Here all the term gets cut. So we are left with 0 as our remainder. Therefore, we get our answer as x square minus 2x minus 35. Now, by division algorithm, we have p of x equal to g of x into q of x plus r of x. Therefore, x4 minus 6x cube minus 26x square plus 138x minus 35 is equal to x square minus 4x plus 1 into x square minus 2x minus 35 plus 0. Hence, the other two zeros of the polynomial P of X are the zeros of the polynomial x square minus 2x minus 35. So solving it, we get x square minus 2x minus 35 is equal to 0, which implies, now splitting the middle term, so we get x square minus 7x plus 5x minus 35 is equal to 0, which implies x into x minus 7 plus 5 into x minus 7 is equal to 0, which implies x plus 5 into x minus 7 is equal to 0, which implies x is equal to minus 5 and x is equal to 7. Therefore, required zeros of P of X are 7, minus 5. I hope you understood the problem. Bye and have a nice day.